from the My Alliant portal. Here's one quick link right here, Career Impact, but that's that's only because it's new. It's always going to be down here. Go down to your quick links, and you can click on Career and Professional Services, and it will take you to here. You're going to automatically be logged in. This is a one-stop shop, so as long as you're logged in to the My Alliant portal, when you click on that link, it takes you directly here. I'm going to give you a brief tutorial on some of the functions that Career Impact can do for you. Let's start with building your profile. It's under My Briefcase, right? You click on My Profile, and you're going to get the My Profile page. And it looks like that. First thing I'm going to do is go ahead and add a photo. You're going to click on this, and it's going to ask, where do you want to get the photo from? That guy kind of looks like me. <laughs> it has to be a JPEG. Okay, that's how you put your profile picture in there. If you want to add some titles, let me show you what a title is. A title is like a specialty you can do. You can do your experience, your activities, your skills. So I'm going to show you how to add one. I'm going to go skills. I'm going to do, let's just say software. I'm going to mastery level. I'm going to put myself as super master. Software name is going to be SPSS. And that's going to be me. And it shows up on my list of talents. Here's a very cool function of Career Impact. Go to Career Path. And it has a survey on careers. If you're not 100% sure what you want to do for the rest of your life. I strongly suggest you take this. I'm going to go ahead and take this. And let me show you what it looks like. This is a liquor scale, right? Strongly dislike, all the way to strongly like. And you get 60 questions. And they tell you, don't overly think about, you know, if you have enough education or training or how much money you would make. Don't think about that at this point. They're just going to go ahead and gauge your career interests and, and send you to one of five different job categories. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and take this. I'm going to pause this video. All right, here's my 60 responses. This whole thing took me about a minute. So we're going to just go to the end here. Click going. Here are my interest profiler results. Top three being realistic, investigative, and artistic. Let me check out investigative and see what that says. Searching for facts. Mathematics, figuring out problems. It's mathematics, engineering. But that's, that's your profiler to see what you should be doing for the rest of your life. Let's move on. All right, the next important thing is My Docs. Click on My Docs, and this is where you can upload all of your important documents, such as your resume, your cover letters, your letters of recommendation, your transcripts, anything that an employer is going to want to see. Just select the file and the file type. And then go ahead and hit the Upload File button. And there it is right there. It's pretty easy. So you should have a long list of documents here in this folder. Next cool thing is click on My Jobs. And you're going to see a list of job offers that people have contacted our school and, and put these things in here for you guys to apply for. And there's a bunch of them, right? You can look at them all if you want. And up here, there is a separate page for internships. And I know you guys need your internships. I think this is a really cool option. The jobs are listed for you, internships listed for you already. Go up here to more job boards. This has its own private search engine for other jobs outside of the ones that have been posted on the Alliant website right here. So let me type something in here. Let's type in math teacher and like New York City. See me, math teachers are needed in New York City. But that's how that would work. You'll notice right here there's a little quick link to indeedjob.com. And, you know, that's got a million jobs on it. So go ahead and use Indeed if you can't find something you like on with the other search engines. So you go to My Activity. It's like a note taker on anything you've done through 
this career impact website, like wh who have you applied to, which campuses you've been planning on having an interview, jobs that you have saved, that kind of thing. But again, this under my activity, this is this is like a giant note taker. It takes it just records everything you've done through this software program. Moving on down the list, go, go ahead and click the Career Experts button, and that's going to take you to our very own Career Services Director. There she is right there. It's our amazing Becky. It has her hours up here. It has her office. Uh, if you want to make an appointment, if you want to email her, if you want to click her email, go ahead and makes a message for you. So it's real easy to get a hold of, of our amazing Becky, the director of the career services. All right. The last thing I'm going to show you in this video is the, what we call the, my channels page. So go ahead and click there and you're going to see many, many videos that will go over some of the finer points on how to get a job. Example, let's say you want to master small talk. You click the button. There are these cool little videos. Great resource. All right, that's it. Please use this Career Impact online resource. It, it's a great thing to help you find a job. <music>